there guys, today we will be doing an interesting noise cancellation test between two apps. On one side, we've got WebEx Noise Cancellation, which is a widely known conferencing app that has recently announced a new noise cancellation feature. And on the other side, we have a standalone noise canceling app called Crisp that mutes background noise in calls and can be used with any conferencing app. We'll be putting these two to the test to see which one performs best. Hello, hello. So we are going to get into the first test and my husband is listening to sports really loud out there. The phone is ringing. It's very loud and chaotic. And so we're going to see what it sounds like when crisp is turned on. So I'm just going to go ahead and click the button to activate crisp and the TV's still going, the phone's still going, but hopefully you can't hear anything. So this is what it sounds like when it's turned off and on again and off again and on again we could keep going on like this forever but i think it's time to test out webex all right now i'm on webex my husband is still listening to sports the phone is still ringing and we are going to compare and see how this sounds compared to press this is an automated feature and so we'll see if there's a noticeable difference all right so i am going to head into the second test now All right, test number two. There's a vacuum going on in the background. I'm sure you can hear it. And I'm also going to be clapping for the sake of this test. So we are going to test this with clapping and with the vacuum going in the background. So this is what it sounds like without Chris. And then I'm going to go ahead and on. I'm still clapping at the same intensity as I was before. The vacuum is still going. Turn it off. This is what it sounds like. And I'll turn it on again for you. There you go. And hopefully, right now, since Crisp is on, hopefully you can't even hear the snapping. So we'll see how that turns out. All right. You know the drill. I'm clapping. I'm on WebEx. And we'll see if you can hear the clapping. The vacuum is still going in the background. So we'll see if you can hear either of those loud. Noises with WebEx. Let's keep going at this for a few more seconds and we'll see how it turns out. Okay, as you can hear in the background, there is a hair dryer, my dog's barking, and somebody's knocking on the door. It's really loud and chaotic. And so let's see what this sounds like with Chris. I'm going to go ahead and remove the noise. All of those things that I just told you about, believe it or not, they're still going on in the background. This is what it sounds like without, and I'll turn it on again, and without. My dog's really going to town on his toy, and on again. So let's try this out with WebEx and see if it has the same effect. Here I am on WebEx, and my dog is barking, he's playing with his toy. Somebody's knocking on the door, and there's a hair dryer going. So we'll see if WebEx's automated noise cancellation feature makes a difference. I don't know if you can hear all those things that are going on right now. I'll be quiet for a second to see if you can hear them. And here I am talking again. So we'll see if this is working and compare it to Chris. I'm in my home office and it's really loud. My husband is grinding coffee beans in the kitchen and there's an alarm clock going off. So let's see if Chris can handle all of this noise. I think this is probably the loudest stuff that we've done. So I will go ahead and hit the remove noise button. And this is what it sounds like when Chris is working. And this is what it sounds like when it's not working. So on and off again, and on and off. All right, so let's hop into the WebEx. So the question here is, can you hear the alarm clock and can you hear the coffee beans being grinded with WebEx? I'm in WebEx right now. So like I said before, this, this feature is automated, so I can't turn it on and off for you. Compared to the last footage, the noise is exactly the same. And so does this automated feature have the same effect as this or not? So we will put them to the test, compare them, and we'll find out which one sounds better. So that's it for the noise cancellation test. Hopefully you had as much fun as I did and let me know in the comments below which app you think did a better job at canceling noises. 
stay safe and thanks for watching. Bye.